Eh? How did we lose one? I think we should throw it in the back. Just to be safe. <laughs> you ever wonder why there's a bank out here? Mm, well, I think it's supposed to be like more of a vault, you know? Oh, that makes sense. Oh, you. You're free to go. <laughs> Not really, but you've got a package. Don't get your hopes up. We've already checked it for anything useful, haven't we, Dave? What? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> of course I checked it. I mean, if I didn't check it, I'd lose my job, and I don't lose my job. <laughs> See you around. You're free to go. <laughs> hmm. Huh? 
Yo, check yourself. What the? Janitor, you don't count. Now, the next time I'll need it. Janitor, you don't count. Now, the next time I'll need you. You're back.
Witness, please continue your testimony. Okay. I was riding alongside my partner in the armored van, but suddenly spotted a bag on the side of the road. We got out and eventually decided to throw the bag in with the others. We didn't know there was someone hiding in there. Objection! So, the defendant crawled into that bag in order to break into the bank. Is that correct? Is it not obvious? Is it really that obvious? I have proof that the defendant didn't hide himself in that bag. Well then... What are you waiting for? Present this evidence already. Take that! What is this? It's evidence. And how exactly does this prove anything? Well, I... <laughs> I was just kidding. Let me try... This is no time for jokes. I see no reason to further prolong this trial. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman... What is this? It's evidence. And how exactly does this prove anything? Well, I... <laughs> I was just kidding. Let me try... This is no time for jokes. I see no reason to further prolong this trial. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman... What is this? It's evidence. And how exactly does this prove anything? Well, I... <laughs> I was just kidding. Let me try... This is no time for jokes. I see no reason to further prolong this trial. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman... What is this? It's evidence. And how exactly does this prove anything? Well, I... <laughs> I was just kidding. Let me try... This is no time for jokes. I see no reason to further prolong this trial. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman... Is... is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. If the defendant really was hiding in this bag, then... How did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? What? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. But then, uh, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. <laughs> what are you saying? I'm saying my client wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stuffed in there. BY THIS VERY WITNESS! Huh? As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. While he was in the bag, he was unconscious! 
This is absurd. The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag, knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag in with the others. But, but why would he do that? Why, to dispose of the body, of course. There are millions of bags of money in that bank, and the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke up and tried to escape from his tomb. He was arrested on the spot, and the witness thought everything was over. But it's come back to haunt him now. You guys can't, you can't, this, this, this can't be happening to me! Well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I am now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman, Yeah, yeah, no, no. Oh, uh. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Is, is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. If the defendant really was hiding in this bag, then... How did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. But then, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. <laughs> what are you saying? I'm saying my client wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stopped in there. By this very witness! <laughs> As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. While he was in the bag, he was unconscious. Th this is absurd. The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag, knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag in with the others. But, but why would he do that? Why, to dispose of the body, of course. There are millions of bags of money in that bank, and the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke up and tried to escape from his tomb. He was arrested on the spot, and the witness thought everything was over. But it's come back to haunt him now, you guys can't, you can't, this, this, this can't be happening to me! Well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I am now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman. Is... is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. If the defendant really was hiding in this bag, then... How did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? What? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. But then, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. <laughs> what are you saying? I'm saying my client wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stopped in there. By this very witness! As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. While he was in the bag, he was unconscious. Th this is absurd. The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag, knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag in with the others. But, but why would he do that? Why, to dispose of the body, of course. There are millions of bags of money in that bank, and the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke up and tried to escape from his tomb. He was arrested on the spot, and the witness thought everything was over. But it's come back to haunt him now. You guys can't, you can't, this, this, this can't be happening to me! Well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I am now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman. Hereby declare the Tunisian archaeological exhibit open. No, thank you. No.
Oh, uh, we got a breach headed towards the medieval section. Uh, roger that. We're prepared to engage over. Whoa. Uh, we got a breach headed towards the medieval section. Uh, roger that. We're preparing to engage over. <laughs> And after that, they just up and arrested him. Whoa, really? Yeah, that's when I decided I should probably get a different job. I figured night garden is much less dangerous than driving a... Sir, place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, I will be forced to fire upon you. Eh? Bribery is a federal offense, sir. Sir, place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, I will be forced to fire upon you. You leave me no choice, sir. <laughs> sir, place your hands where I can <laughs> Sir, place your hands where I can see them.
Welcome.
And after that, they just stopped and arrested him. Whoa, really? Yeah. So apparently there was something in that cake and uh, he used it to escape and then I got fired. Pretty lame, huh? Yeah, I don't really like this. Uh, please shut up. Oh, I just, I was, I was just trying to have a conversation, you know, since, I mean, we're partners, so I just. Ah! I just, I was, I was just trying to have a conversation. I just, I was, I was just trying to have a conversation, you know, since, I mean, we're partners, so I just, just wanted to get, get to know each other a little bit, you know? I just kind of wanted to have a conversation. It's just, you know, just to lighten things up. I mean, what's going to happen in a museum? I mean, really. You feel a draft at all? Hey! I just, I was, I just, uh, I gotta warn some.
Uh, sir? Y you might want to come look at this. I'm getting chaos readings at 10.6. It's coming from the museum. My god. It's over 9? Yeah. I'm leaving this decision up to you, Corporal. Just hit one of those buttons to deal with this pressing situation. Who's watching TV? Get back to work! <laughs> Sorry, Chief. Sir, y you might want to come look at this. I'm getting chaos readings at 10.6. It's coming from the museum. My god, it's over 9? Yeah, I'm leaving this decision up to you, Corporal. Just hit one of those buttons to deal with this pressing situation. Who's watching TV? Get back to work! <laughs> Sorry, Chief.
decided to wake up. You've been quite elusive, but your skills make you worth the catch. You'll be perfect for the job. We've been having some issues with a group of thieves known as the Top Hat Clan. We know they're guilty, we just can't pin them down in crimes. You'll be going into the airship to bring them down. I don't need to remind you that we've got you on several charges. Attempting robbery, breaking yourself out of prison, <laughs> even stealing a Tunisian diamond. We've got quite a lot of counts on you. Do this job right, and we'll drop all charges against you. Charlie here will be bringing you close to the airship. The rest is up to you. Find a way to bring him down, and you'll be a free man. Hey, uh, how do you want me to bring you in? Right, so if we go up to three caliber... Hey, you there. What do you think you're doing? It's Smith, right? What are you doing here, mate? Your wife's just gone into labor. Take that escape pod behind you. It'll take you right to the hospital. Go ahead. Don't worry, I'll tell the chief. how much a solid gold cannon would weigh, don't you? Phew, we totally got enough power. What do you think, man? Well, I'm still kinda new here, so I'm not really sure what to say. <laughs> Door's jammed again. Oh, hey, uh, you see that record sign? Where it says records? That'd probably be a good place to look, right? Let me just, uh, help you get across that gap. Alright, here I come. 
Okay, uh, let me just uh, teleport this thing in here for you. Yeah. yeah, I have this thing here that can manipulate gravity. Should be able to get you to float across. Let me just... Nobody knows about this, or we'd be in a lot of trouble. Mm. Oh man, that duck just flew right into the propeller. Oh, what a mess. Oh man, I remember this. Good thing nobody knows about this, or we'd be in a lot of trouble. Oh man, I remember this. Good thing nobody knows about this or we'd be in a lot of trouble. Mm. Falcon! Oh man, I remember this. Good thing nobody knows about this or we'd be in a lot of trouble. Mm. Ooh. Oh, hello Mr. Spider. Alright, you got some evidence. Oh wait, wait. There's no way you're getting through there. Lots of guys, and there's lots of guns, that's all I'm gonna say. It looks like you can get around if you go through that air duct. Alright, I've hacked into their power grid. What do you want me to do? Alright, I've hacked into their power grid. What do you want me to do? Okay, I'll reroute the power to a random room, that's fine. Alright, Henry, you're almost there. I'm right outside, so just open the bay doors and I'll uh, get you on the chopper. Hey, what are you doing? Yeah, uh, we got a situation in Cargo Bay.
I've been, I've been looking at the numbers here. What do you think? Ah, yes. Let me have a look. Go, go. I'll hold him off. Come on, then. Oh. 
Let's hurry up now. Activate the doors.
Help, help. my right hand man I surrender the airship to you You think they're all right? Pretty big fall. I'm sure Henry had a plan. What is it? Henry! <laughs>
You could let me out of here? Oh, thank you. Like he set off some sort of alarm in the vault. What? He's going rogue? All right, move to Plan B. Call in reinforcements and move in. <laughs> yeah, this is Jeffrey. Uh, I got him right here, so you guys don't need.
got the ruby. Now forget about it. We've got to retreat, or else the topic clan will be history. Orders, Ken. Let him go. What? We got what we came for. He's now worth the trouble. criminals are kept here, and now we have the infamous Henry Stickman. You're going to be here for a long time. Grigori, take him. You wait here until cell found. <laughs> Is Grigori? Huh? Yeah, you know new one, Henry? He's dead. Yes. Put him with others. Okay. Oh no no! Yes, go ahead. Yeah, it looks like uh, Henry Stickman. Stick Stickman. Yeah, Henry Stickman has escaped. Mm -hmm. You still there? Attention! We have an escaped convict. He was last seen heading towards the surface. Don't oh, make me do this myself.
He's up there somewhere. We cannot let him get through this gate. Oh, nice art. <laughs> hey, you want to trade arts? Yours looks so nice. Frosty's escaping! Hey, you want to trade up? Say, Henry, I'm impressed. Really, I am. You're the first person to escape the wall, but this is the end for you. You've got two options. I have to say, Henry, I'm impressed. Really, I am. You're the first person to escape the wall, but this is the end for you. You've got two options here, Henry. You stay in there. Whoa! I have to say, Henry, I'm impressed. Really, I am. You're the first person to escape the wall, but this is the end for you. You've got two options here, Henry. You stay in there, or you return with... You made the right choice. to say, Henry, I'm impressed. Really, I am. You're the first person to escape the wall, but this is the end for you. You've got two options here, Henry. You stay in there, or you return with us back to the complex. What's it going to be, Henry? Hmm, well, that's just too bad. Alright, everyone, back to work. I will not forget about this. This is coming out of your paycheck, all of you. Sir, I got a message. Yes, go ahead. Yeah, it looks like uh, Henry Stickman. Stick Stickman. Yeah, Henry Stickman has escaped. Mm -hmm. You still there? Attention, we have an escaped convict. He's last seen heading towards the surface. Don't make me do this myself. All right, let's go. Have a good time. <coughs> Come on now, brothers! My life for us! <laughs>
Yeah? Oh, Henry! Oh, how's it going? Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh. Uh-huh. Oh, I see. Huh. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm flying right now, actually. Where, uh, where are you? Hmm, the wall. Yeah, I think I've heard of that place. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm on a mission, but, uh, I should have some time to swing by. Hey, so, uh, I'm getting pretty close. Yeah, just uh, try to get outside and I'll, I'll, uh, you know. Hey. Where are you going? What? Mm. Hey, so, uh, I see the wall. Oh, you're outside? Nice. I think I see you. Yeah, there's a guard in the way. I got this. Yeah, it'll, it'll be just like the old times. Yeah. I got the perfect plan. This is the greatest plan. Got him. Wait. Hey, I'm seeing a helipad up here. Could be a pretty good place to get picked up. Uh, once I get close, though, they'll uh, they'll probably raise the alarm. Oh, yeah, they see me. I'm coming in. Get ready. Jump off the edge. Wait, was that the plan? 
Man, we really should have coordinated that better. I mean, I was not prepared at all. Yes, hello. Henry? What are you? Eh, uh, in a complex called the wall? Oh, yeah, yes, of course, sir. We'll, uh, we'll be right there. Uh, sit tight. Uh, I I'll let you know when we're close. Mm. Where, where exactly are you? <laughs> Cafeteria? Mm, okay, got the map here. Uh, yes, there you are. Alright, how do you want to do this? Hey, Henry! It's me! Yeah, I'm, I'm undercover! Yeah, I'm here to break you out! What? That was a close one, Henry. But I'm not going to pull you up. See, without you, I become the leader of the Tuppet Clan again. I just wanted to look you in the eyes as I took it all back. Goodbye.
Thanks. And I'm like, look at how much I care. I don't care. I ended up buffing up my guys and doing like 70 damage. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Oh yeah, last night. Oh yeah, last night I kept facing the same deck. Hey, buddy. Oh yeah, last night I kept facing the same deck. Oh yeah, last night I kept. <laughs> If we can get you up there, you could get in and open this door. You say all inmates out of cell. Yeah, some idiot. Hey, I just grabbed these. Maybe they'll come in handy. Are we waiting for someone or I thought you press. We'll regroup with a uh, third floor. We'll help them clear out maximum security. What do you think? Duh, I like. Who get the guards? Hold the elevator. Thanks. Can you believe this inmate outbreak? Crazy, huh? Yes, it is pretty crazy. Oh, are you guys new here? Oh yeah, we transferred from the eighth floor. From the cafeteria. Nice try, inmates.
we'll regroup with that. There is convict here. Get down on ground. <laughs> Back to your cell inmate. Doing? Twack! You win! Perfect. What, you think that will upset me? Oh, very much. Thanks, I guess. Now let's get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we're good. Eh. Uh, who's driving? Isn't Henry. There has not been an incident here in 50 years, and the day you show up, this happens. You are going to regret everything. So at this point, he has only like 10 health left, and he plays, the gates are open, and I'm like, look at how much I care. I don't care. Mm -hmm. I ended up buffing up my guys and doing like 70 damage. Mm -hmm. I ended up buffing up my guys and doing... Was that the convict? Uh, yeah, I think so. What are we supposed to do when someone tries to escape again? Uh, I think shoot him. Ah, yes, that sounds right. Mm -hmm. I ended up buffing up my guys and... Oh, come on. Are you serious? <laughs> that was totally you. You what? Don't you accuse me. Come on, just admit it. It wasn't me. Boys, lunch is on me.
Pero, 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 Just a box. Someone just leave. I think it was Smith. Oh uh, yeah, probably off to see his family. Yeah. We'll regroup with that. There is convict here. Get down on ground. <laughs> no, I don't like it. <laughs> Help! Back to your cell, inmate. Domain? Twack! Yes, hello. Henry? Where are you? Eh, uh, in the complex? Called the wall? Oh, yeah, yes, of course, sir. We'll, uh, we'll be right there. Uh, sit tight. Uh, I I'll let you know when we're close. Mm. Where, where exactly are you? <laughs> Cafeteria. Oh, okay, got the map here. Uh, yes, there you are. All right. How do you want to do this?